Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Renee. If you watch my videos and follow me on Instagram, you know that I purchased a Chanel 2020C beige rectangular mini recently. And this is the original strap length on me. As you can see, it sits below my hip when I wear it as a shoulder bag. For reference, I'm 5'3 or 162 centimeters. I'm definitely on the petite side. And also when I wear it crossbody, it still looks a little bit long. So in today's video, I want to share with you multiple ways to adjust the strap length of my Chanel Rectangular Mini and different ways to wear it because it is a very versatile bag in my opinion and I want to get the most use out of it. And the ways that I show you in this video can also be used on other handbags if you want to adjust the strap length. I hope you find this video helpful and let's get started. The first way to adjust the strap length is to use a ribbon or even a tulle, just anything that you have at home that can tie a knot. I'm using an Hermes ribbon because it is very thin. So what you will need to do is very easy. You just need to decide the strap length that you want and tie a knot at the spot that you like. So I'm just giving you an example to tie in the middle of the two straps. You just need to pull the two straps together and tie a knot in the middle. And after you tie a knot, you can cut it if the ribbon is still too long and no one else can see the ribbon because it will be completely hidden inside the bag. And this is a before and after comparison. It looks so much better right now and I can wear it as a shoulder bag and also I can wear it crossbody. To me, this is a much better length for petites, including myself. The second way to adjust the strap length is to use a metal buckle clasp. You can ask your Chanel essay to get one for free and I will show you a picture on the screen that how the buckle clasp from Chanel looks like. But if you don't have any Chanel bags, you can also purchase it on Amazon or Etsy. I purchased mine on Amazon and it comes in different finishes. I picked the gold finish one because I want to match with my champagne gold hardware. I will also leave the links in the description box down below for you to check them out. It's very easy to use. You just need to open the middle bar first and then you hook the buckle to the string straps. I will show you a close up so you will understand what I'm talking about. This way would be much neater than the first way using a ribbon, but I would not recommend to leave the buckle clasp on all the time because it might ruin the leather around it. So because you can tie the ribbon or hook the buckle clasp wherever you want, so with the same concept, you can shorten the string strap much more. Right now, I can wear it as a top handle bag and it just looks very cute. I love the look and I can also wear it on my shoulder. I will definitely try to use it in this way when I go to some formal events. The other way to wear it as a shoulder bag is to use it with double strap and you don't need anything to adjust the strap length. It is also very simple and quick. You just need to grab one of the straps on one side and wrap it around the other side. And then you can close the bag and the strap length will be shortened and it reminds me of the medium classic flap right now because the medium classic flap has double straps. The last way to wear this bag is to use it as a clutch. Again, at some point easy, you just need to hide all the straps into the bag. Only leave a small piece on the top because it is a mini size so I thought it would be nice to use as a clutch too. And this is one of the ways that I will use when I go to a formal event. If you know other ways to wear this bag, please comment down below to share and I would love to learn. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Happy holidays and I will see you in my next video.